I, I want to be right there. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that That's cool. just great. Oh, wow. Just gorgeous. You want to you wanna just sit down for a second? Yeah, yeah, let's sit. <laughs> That's great. Thanks. I really, I tell you, I just love lunch. Yeah, it's just great. It was so good. Well, that's interesting that you'd say that. Yeah. You know, I was, I was just thinking about something, and uh, you read Martha Stewart Living, right? That's really random, but <laughs> yeah. Well, you know, some of her recipes are impossible. Like, say she's got this fancy cookie recipe. Mm -hmm. You can never find all the ingredients. <laughs> Cardamom. Mongolian pine nuts, bitter Belgian chocolate, <laughs> <laughs> butter from sheep's milk. Where do you get that stuff? <laughs> you can't go from store to store forever. <laughs> you gotta bake the damn cookies. So you make do with what you've got. Hershey's Kisses and Parquet. When they come out of the oven, they're fine, but they don't blow you away. They're just another kind of cookie. How do I explain this? I've dated a lot. Uh. Uh, oh, not a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I've dated enough. And when you say, I love you, that's the cookie you baked with what you could find at the other person's store. Maybe it tastes okay, but it's not extraordinary. It's not the cookie that Martha led you to expect. Then one day, you find this amazing gourmet grocery that has all the ingredients you've been looking for in one place. Sheet milk butter and all. <laughs> and when they come out of the oven, they smell fantastic. They look even better and they taste like nothing you've ever had before. What I'm trying to say is you're my specialty store. <laughs> 